Russell, thank you. Some St. Louis County restaurants are taking chances deciding to defy orders to close their dining rooms. A number of owners and the Missouri Restaurant Association are even taking it further, deciding to sue. Tonight News 4's Emma Hogue talks to some of the businesses staying open. Emma is in Chesterfield. Tonight, Satchmo's Bar and Grill is open and the owner hopes to stay open for as long as he can. He tells me defying these orders is worth the risk and if he closes, he'll have to lay off several employees and potentially close for good. I think that the reason people are defying it is just because the cost of complying outweighs the risks of not complying. I mean, some people are just at the end of the line and this is survival for them. I mean, they, they put everything into building these businesses and just seeing everything stripped from right before their eyes. For days, county leaders have told us they will crack down on businesses, but only if they get complaints. The county counselor's office could file a temporary restraining order closing the business until a judge rules or the case could head to county prosecutor Wesley Bell's office. Satchmo's is just one of several restaurants telling me they will continue to offer indoor dining. Bartolino's in South County, Joey B's on Manchester, and Giannino's in South County say they'll stay open too. Owners worry these restrictions will last longer than a month. I don't know how you could really buy into the idea that this is only going to last four weeks. I think that the longer it goes on, the worse it's going to get and the more people that are going to lose their jobs and the more places are never going to open up again. I didn't think what Sam Page had instituted was fair for the St. Louis County restaurants, especially since the restaurants in the city are open. So I decided I knew the Satchmos would be open today and defying the order or not defying the order, I wanted to come and support them and have some lunch. In the last hour, the county tells me it's received seven complaints about restaurants not following orders, although it's still unclear what, if any, further action will be taken. Satchmo's, the Missouri Restaurant Association, and Bartolino South are all part of a joint lawsuit suing Dr. Sam Page's office over this indoor dining ban. I'm told that lawsuit will be filed before the end of today. Reporting in Chesterfield tonight, Emma Hogue, News 4.